In this video we're going to create a simple program and download it to the BBC Microbit. First up we're going to plug our Microbit in with a USB cable capable of data transfer. And you'll see the yellow LED light up to indicate that it's receiving power over USB. Uh, you also see the Microbit appear as a drive on your computer with a couple of files on it and it's here that we're going to save our program. From the Microbit website, we'll go to Let's Code and then we choose our editor of choice. In this case, we're going with the JavaScript Blocks Editor. We will create a new project. And here we see the workspace where we create our code and put our blocks together, the toolbox that contains the blocks of code for our program and the simulator which will show what happens on the microbit before we download it. So we're just going to remove our on start blocks, we're not going to use that, and in our forever loop we're going to create a show icon, add that, I'm going to change that to a smiley face, and then we're going to add a pause, let's make that for a second, and then let's duplicate our show icon and change that to a confused face. And that loop's just going to play forever now. And you can see that happening on our simulator, so we know what's going to happen when we download it. So I'll give it a name. Click download and then I can choose where to save my program. Most browsers will let you choose your download location and in this case I'm going to save it straight to the microbit. Once that flash is complete you can see the yellow LED lighting up. The program starts playing on the microbit. So you've successfully downloaded your first program to the BBC microbit.